Hey, 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 what's going on, good people? What is going on? I am Rochelle T. Parks. I am your health motivator. Hey, guys, welcome, welcome, welcome to the U52 Studios, where we will get this workout in today. Guys, listen, before we work out, we got to warm up this body, okay? You never want to start working before you warm up, okay? This is the order. We warm up, we stretch, and then we work, okay? Warm up, stretch, work. That's before any type of exercise activity, okay? So what we want to do, it's going to take about 8 to 10 minutes, right? 8 to 10 minutes, um, and we're going to warm up from, we're going to warm up the body, and then we're going to stretch from head to toe, right? So we warm up the body, get the blood circulating a little bit, right? Kind of prepare the body for work, and then we stretch from head to toe, okay? So we typically start with just, I just start with just marching in place, right? Marching in place. <sighs> Breathe. It's not a race, just march in place. March in place. Get those knees up. Get them up. Right? We're just preparing the body for work. That's how I want you to think of this. Preparing the body for work. Okay? Now watch this. Watch this. Now I want you to take it out wide. Take it out wide. Just opening up those hips a little bit. Opening up the groin a little bit. Take it out wide. Get those knees up as high as you can. Look, go as slow as you need to go. Okay? Go as slow as you need to go. Then we're going to bring it back to the center. Oh, yeah. Getting the heart rate up a little bit. Always start marching in place. And then after that, you want to jog in place. You just start with a light jog. <sighs> Breathe. <sighs> Let the body, look, don't tense up. Just light jog. <sighs> light jog. <sighs> in through your nose. Out through your mouth. <sighs> in through your nose. Out through your mouth. Light jogs. You get this, get the blood circulating a little bit, coursing through those veins, through those blood vessels. Get the heart rate up a little bit. We're preparing the body for work. So we must warm up, stretch, and then work. You typically do this for about two minutes, one to two minutes. You hear that? You hear my breathing? Preparing the body for work. Do some butt kicks. <sighs> All right. Okay. Now that the body is warmed up, guys, this is a perfect opportunity to get yourself a heart rate monitor so you can see your heart rate start to rise, right? I have one here. You can see your heart rate start to rise. Now we're gonna stretch. Again, we're gonna stretch from head to toe. First thing we're gonna do is the neck rotation. Put your hands on your hips, feet about shoulder width apart, and you just rotate your neck. Just rotate your neck. Don't go fast, okay? We don't want anybody to get dizzy. Slow rotation. Stop, and then we reverse. If you're dizzy, you're going too fast. If you have, if you experience anything like vertigo or some type of uh, imbalance, um, then don't do this, okay? All right, and stop. So that was the uh, neck. Next thing we want to do, we want to hit these shoulders, right? Arm and shoulder rotation. Put your arms out to the side. Palms are facing outward, right? Straight to the side, and then just small circles. Small circles, this arm and shoulder rotation. A lot of people have experienced a lot of rotator cuff injuries, be it uh, from an old sports injury, accident, some type of fall, right? Small circles, palms are out, right? Now, this is what I want you to do. Palms down, big circles, big circles. Yeah, don't you feel that? Woo, feels good, feels great. In the military, we used to say, more PT, drill sergeant, more PT. Ha. Okay, you feel that? Mm-hmm. Okay, now we went forward. Now let's reverse it. Palms are out again, and you go small circles, reverse. Reverse, okay? Small circles, make sure your arms are out to the side. They tend to want to drift forward, out to the side. Right, we want that full stretch. 
right? Now watch this, palms are down. Ah, big circles, come on. Ah, wide as you can. Ooh, yes, feels good, feels great. Ah, mm, okay, now give me some huggers, come on. Love yourself, listen. If, if, if nobody else can love you, you can at least love you. Love you. I love me some me, okay? Love yourself. Hug yourself. Come on. This feels good, too. This feels good. So listen, we, we rotated the neck. We got the arm and shoulder, okay? Now look, let's do uh, some overhead tricep extension. Overhead tricep extension, okay? Take the small of your hand, right? Put it in the small of your back. Grab your elbow and pull. You can start with either arm. You can take your right hand, pull it in the small of your back, and pull your elbow with your left hand, okay? Mm, just pull toward the rear. We're stretching out those tricep muscles. Those tricep muscles, okay? And switch. Now I'm gonna take my left hand, put it in the small of my back, take my right, and pull on that left elbow. Stretching out those triceps. Listen, because we're going to work them today. So we're warming up everything, getting everything stretched out. But the whole purpose of this is to prevent injuries, right? We're preventing injuries. Now watch this. Let's do that upper back stretch. Upper back stretch. So hands, clasp them, turn them inside out, and stretch, okay? Like so. Like this. Knees are bent. Uh, kind of round the back. We're stretching that upper back. Okay, upper back. Watch. Watch. Hands inside out. Stretch. All right, all right, all right. Ah. Okay, that's the upper back stretch. Now let's do the chest stretch. Feet by shoulder width apart. Hands together. Okay, then I just want you to open wide. Palms are facing upward. Big stretch. Open wide, open wide. Let's open up that chest cavity. We're stretching, we're stretching, we're stretching. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, and we're done. All right, we got the neck, we got the arm and shoulders, we got the tricep, we got the upper back, we got the chest. Now let's go down low. Let's stretch out those hamstrings. All right, open them up wide for me, okay? And just let it hang. Just let it hang. Ooh, glory. Glory, glory, that feels good. You should feel pulling in the back of your thighs. Those are your hamstring muscles. Just let it hang, guys. Don't tense up, just let it hang. Now listen, I want you to rotate slightly to your left. I'm gonna rotate to my right. You should feel pulling in the back of your left leg. That's your left hamstring muscle. You should feel the pulling, right? Don't bounce, just stay right there. Hold it, hold it, hold it. All right, now rotate to the other side. You go to your right, I'm going to my left. You should feel pulling in the back of your right hamstring muscle. Yes, 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 I love it, I love it. Doesn't that feel good? Yes. All right, now come back, let's stretch that groin. Let's stretch that groin. So what I want you to do, hands on the floor, right? You're gonna bend your knee and rest your knees on your elbows. Woo, let's open up that groin. You feel that stretch? Mm-hmm. Just let it rest on the elbows. That feels great. That feels great. Ah. Ah, okay. Go back up. Roll up slowly. We don't need anybody passing out. Okay, slowly. Now listen, just go side to side for me. Side to side. Side to side. Side to side. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Woo, we're getting those arms. Not those arms, not those arms. We got those arms, we getting those legs warmed up. Okay, okay, listen, we got neck, we got arm and shoulder, we got chest, we got upper back, we got tricep, we got hamstrings. Now let's get these quads, okay? Now you might need to hold on to something, that's okay if you need to grab a chair for balance, whatever, but I just want you to grab either foot. I'm gonna grab my right foot, right? and I need that knee to point downward. Okay, we, listen, that ain't it. Point, oh, you may hop a bit. Point downward, pulling that foot to the rear, right? Pulling up, I'm pulling my foot up toward my buttocks, okay? There's another hop. Other foot, okay? Stretching out the thigh muscle, okay? That's your quadricep. I want the knee pointing downward, downward, downward. Oh yeah. 
all we're doing here is you know reducing our chance of injury okay so listen we got the quads now let's get this knee and ankle knee and ankle this is something people overlook all the time they go out there start running their ankles are tight they may roll the ankle sprain the ankle no no ain't nobody got time for no injuries okay ain't nobody got time for it on your tippy toes and just rotate knee and ankle you may hear a little snap crackle pop come through <laughs> oh you hear that oh yeah then reverse it Other way, other foot. Ah, ooh, that was a big one. Snap, crackle, pop. Other way. Ah, and that is it, guys. Listen, anything you want to stretch, any additional stretches you want to do. Basically, if you want to concentrate more on your upper body, uh, more um, lower body, do some 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 stretches to uh, stretch out your abs because you're gonna do an extreme ab workout. Anything, anything you need to do, do it. Ain't nobody got time for injuries, okay? But you need to do it. Don't go right into a workout without warming up and stretching, okay? I'm giving you the best of what I got, guys. I, listen, I'm trying to give you the answers to the test, okay? Listen, you know what I say. Look on my Scantron, okay? Look on my Scantron. You'll pass, all right? Hey, listen, that's all I got. That's all I got, guys. Um, get your water. Get your towel, get your towel right, because you want to be able to hydrate, okay? Don't go into a workout and be like, oh my God, I forgot my water. No, 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 no. If you have to stop, you stop, okay? Get your head right, guys. Prepare your body for work. Come on, let's go. Hey, this is Rochelle T. Parks. I am your health motivator, and guess what? Whether you like it or not, I do not care, okay? I can, I will, and I must continue to walk alongside you and help you to achieve optimal health. Let's get this work. Peace.